guys, Lifelong Omega here, and oh my gosh, I have dealt with so much. I've been trying to find what we're on right now, which was a space anomaly because it's supposed to be the Atlas space station. Um, and as you can see, I got a new ship. I found a crashed ship somewhere, and this is what I got. It only has one slot more than I had, but that one slot has been extra helpful. Um, but yeah, so my game has been constantly crashing over and over and over again, and I've been trying to find this, and finally it popped up, and hopefully the game doesn't crash while I'm recording, but I decided to go ahead and make another episode here, because I finally found this, and this is uh, semi-important, because one of the things about this is that uh, it should give me an Atlas card, which can open some of those crates we've been seeing, and some of the doors and some space stations. Yeah, but I'll talk to you in a second. Can I talk to you? Okay, I can. Okay, I think this guy just wants to trade, uh, uh, multiple with me. I'm still on my other one. Uh, a lot of things really didn't change except for my ship. Sorry, I didn't read that. I'm used to not reading it. Uh, okay, so I got a blueprint. Yep, there's the Atlas Pass. Perfect. It's just what we needed. At least one of the things, was it? Better than the multi-tool I have? I've been, like, struggling to find a multi-tool, because like I said in the last episode, I don't know how to make the analysis thing, and I'm so afraid of losing that. Um, but yeah, we need to talk to this guy. Um, and he should give us a choice to either skip over everything and like skip to the center of the universe or uh, rare linguistic form pleasure not a some some uh, route to the galactic core reconnect with Atlas for guidance resources for journey yes or no uh, as I approach the electronic being it springs to life from its dark mass scanning beams emerge and envelop me there's an unnerving chittering sound and then unbelievably it speaks in my language it offers me a choice it can show me how to harness black holes in order to embark upon a journey to the center of the galaxy. It can light my way to an atlas interface so I may follow a path, or it will assist me in my own exploration. So I can either get resources, find a shortcut, and resume the path. And yeah, I know it's kind of like cheating, I guess. I mean, it's not really cheating, but I'm going to go ahead and do the find a shortcut just because I think going through a black hole would be friggin awesome um i don't know how that's gonna really impact the story and everything uh hopefully this doesn't, this doesn't put me like further away from the galaxy because finding those cell or like making the cells is like really hard hang on if i can open these i'm gonna open them what card does this need can't even open that one okay let's try this one can't even open that one <laughs> So that was a complete waste of just turn around. But anyway, uh, yeah, we're gonna go find the black hole. And we're gonna go through it. But yeah, it's taking me forever to find it. Because it popped up and then my game crashed and it wasn't there again. And I don't know why. Um, Okay, it said black hole, but where? See that, that, this puts us back on the regular path, but where's that black hole? Okay, so it does say black hole right there, right? I'm not... That, that did say black hole. Yeah, that says black hole. Okay, so... What we need to do... Is we need a warp... Uh, over there. So that's two warps. Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Um... Hopefully we can... Hopefully this next area has, uh, resources that... 
we can use because um, I've landed on like two or three plants where I had to buy the actual uh, thing from the market because I wasn't able to make a warp cell just from the planets that I was on. Um, it was like missing stuff. I don't know if that was a plan or if it was just buggy or something. But yeah. Also, I realize these take a long time. I, I think I said in the last episode too, it's pretty much how it would be uh, in real life. It's light years away, essentially. So, you gotta, you gotta remember that. Um, but yeah. Uh, Do I even have enough? I might have enough. Uh. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go and farm all this and get all the necessary things, and I'll be back whenever I have enough for the black hole. Um, I got I got all the uh resources for the uh warp cell, so we are on our way to the black hole to uh pretty much just jump in ship first um hopefully there's a space station there uh i haven't saved yet uh, i mean i did save whenever i landed on the planet but that was a while ago uh so hopefully there's a space station here okay there is oh gosh please don't fly into it just yet <laughs> i do not want to fly into you just yet just give me a second but don't pull me in either yeah, we're gonna pull off on this space station. Uh, we're gonna go talk to the guy, because I enjoy talking to all of them, uh, just to see what they'll give me and blueprints and then uh, standing with them and everything. So, let's see what this space station holds. I really want. Okay, there was a ship earlier, and I wish I had gotten it on video. Uh, but it was huge, and it was worth 5 million credits. Crazy! I was like, I'll never have that much. But do you have like 31 slots or something? Oh my gosh, I keep breathing in the mic. I always do that. I'm sorry. I just don't know if the game will like overpower me or something. And, yeah, you know. I really just need a new setup. Get like one of those uh, regular mics, not my headset mic or a little uh, thing on the mic to stop that from happening. I still don't know what everyone's saying though, and it's so upsetting. Uh, snarls at me and its fingers hover over the injector, which can surely cause damage to life limb or equipment. It begins its interrogation. Can I pull rank? Okay, I'll do that. I enjoy gifts. Okay, we got. Ooh. Okay, I've been looking for this too. It's a hyperdrive uh, upgrade, pretty much, and it'll let us jump further. So uh, it'll like pretty much let us jump two planets, three planets, depending on what upgrade it is. Uh, so as soon as I can get that, I'll get that. Hey, bud. Uh, oh, darn it! I'm gonna go back in just to just to save. right oh I thought it disappeared I was getting a little worried uh, come on get further further away from it all right here we go Woo! do I just enter it like anywhere oh, I don't know. do I just drive into it well here we go and yes I know I'm not discovering plants and stuff 
bad. But I'm definitely more focused on the uh, center of the river. Like, do I just try it? Well, here we go. That's not the center of the universe. Gosh darn it. I thought I was here. Um, hold on. Okay, so I think this is where we were. Right? That's where we were, right? Ah, oh, we should have talked to that guy more. See, one of the things that upsets me is that once I, like, close out of these waypoints, all that goes away. I mean, I could easily just go over here. Yeah, I don't even know where we were. We had to have been in this area, right? I don't know, but the path towards the gl all that's gone now. I mean, yeah, the Atlas interface is over there. I think that says black hole. I'm not sure. Um, no, it probably just says that. Ah, we should have talked to them more. Um, I just want to see how much ha we have left, because I was trying to follow this earlier, and it it just it kept getting like uh, the line kept getting smaller and smaller. I guess more uh, or less visible. Is this the end? Nope, there's more. So where does it end? Like I know there's a center somewhere. I guess that was just a, I guess it was really a shortcut. Um, it just didn't take us all the way. So, more grinding, I guess. Let's go check out this space station and uh, see what we got here. don't have iron, which is uh, a problem. Can this one open? I don't think any of these can, yeah, that's V3. And I don't think they can stack. I don't think it works like that. I think you actually have to find the recipe for them. Uh, yeah, that's V3. So. It's probably just the stuff on the planet that has the V1 pass. 
Yes, how are you? I don't know a thing you're saying. Uh, I can only give you 10 carbon. It teaches as much of the dialect, but it's only going to teach me one word. Okay. So, I think I'm going to just end it here. Uh, I know this is like a really short episode, but I was really just wanting to show uh, the whole space anomaly and then the black hole because I knew I was, I already knew I was going to go through that. Um, so anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.